Qualcomm showcased its technological prowess at its hottest event of the year, announcing a treasure trove of new products and innovations. Didn't have time to tune in live? That's okay. Today, we'll tell you everything you need to know about the Snapdragon Summit 2023 event. Here's the million dollar question. What's Qualcomm got cooking for us this time? Will it be a new Snapdragon mobile chip or a new CPU? or possibly an update on new AI projects? Let's find out. But first, if you're excited to know about these updates, then go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Qualcomm announced its next generation flagship processor, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, which will power flagship Android devices in 2024. The new chip is more powerful and efficient than the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2, but the most noticeable change here is a strong focus on AI. The Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 AI engine features on-device generative AI models. Qualcomm has collaborated with Meta to run the Llama 2 model locally on their chip. At launch, it supports more than 20 generative AI models, including large language models LLM from Meta and stable diffusion for image creation. It also supports creative AI camera features, like removing objects from images and videos, creating fake backgrounds, enhancing certain parts of photos, taking HDR photos in real time, and creating a vlogger view that lets you take shots with the rear and front cameras simultaneously. The 8 Gen 3 is manufactured using a TSMC 4 nanometer process based on Qualcomm Cryo 64-bit architecture. It's equipped with a main processor core that can reach a clock speed of up to 3.3 gigahertz thanks to ARM Cortex X4 technology, plus five performance cores that can reach a speed of up to 3.2 gigahertz and two efficiency cores that can reach a speed of up to 2.3 gigahertz. According to Qualcomm, the new chips offer 30% better performance and 20% more power efficiency than its predecessor. It also offers 25% better GPU performance and 20% more power efficiency Efficiency. The Adreno 750 GPU supports hardware ray tracing and 240 FPS games. It also supports 5G and comes with a Snapdragon X75 5G modem, along with support for LPDDR5X RAM, UFS 4.0, Wi-Fi 7, and Quad HD Plus display support with refresh rates up to 144 Hz and support for 4K resolution at 60 Hz refresh rate. Additionally, it also has Bluetooth 5.4 and supports 108 megapixel cameras to record videos up to 4K at 120 frames per second. The 8 Gen 3 also supports Qualcomm Seamless and can connect to the S7 and S7 Pro audio platforms. More on that later. These new chips will power Samsung's Galaxy S24 series in particular, along with Xiaomi's 14 series, Realme's flagships, OnePlus 12 series, and more. Now moving on to the PC hardware. The Snapdragon X Elite is Qualcomm's next generation desktop chip. Based on the custom integrated Qualcomm Orion CPU architecture, the new X Elite targets Apple's M series with colossal performance and efficiency. It's based on technology from Nuvia, a startup Qualcomm acquired in 2021. The X Elite is based on TSMC's 4 nanometer fabrication process. It has 12 CPU cores clocked at 3.8 gigahertz and can reach up to 4.3 gigahertz with single and dual core boosts. It also has an Adreno GPU with 4.6 teraflops and DX12 API support, which offers better gaming performance and improved graphics. It also supports LPDDR5X memory up to 64 gigabytes and the latest SD version 3.0 memory with UFS 4.0 seeds. In terms of connectivity, the X Elite features the latest Wi-Fi 7 and Bluetooth 5.4. It promises up to 2x better performance and efficiency than Apple's M-series processors. Qualcomm claims the X Elite will outperform Intel's Core i7 and have a 50% faster peak multi-thread performance than the Apple M2 processor. PCs with the Qualcomm Snapdragon X Elite will hit the market in mid-2024. Qualcomm also announced a new S7 and S7 Pro Gen 1 sound platform for earbuds, headphones, speakers, and mobile and computing devices. The new audio platform features high performance with low power consumption and advanced connectivity features. The S7 Pro Sound platform is the first to support Qualcomm Expanded Personal Area Network Technology, or XPAN, and MicroPower Wi-Fi connectivity to extend the audio range of the device. This offers a significantly better range compared to Bluetooth technology. The S7 and S7 Pro also feature on-device AI for better audio personalization. It supports lossless music stretching up to 192 kilohertz and enhanced multi-channel spatial audio for gaming. It also supports Qualcomm Seamless for better cross-device connectivity 
Audio Technica, Bose, Edify, Fio, Jabra, LG, Master and Dynamic, Shure, and other brands are the first to adopt the new S7 and S7 Pro. Qualcomm also announced Seamless Connect, which aims to build an ecosystem that connects Android, Windows, and Snapdragon devices to seamlessly deliver a unified experience across all devices. This feature will be built into the latest 8 Gen 3 mobile processors and Exelite desktop CPUs. In the future, Snapdragon Seamless will also be available on AR and IoT platforms. Companies such as Microsoft, Android, Xiaomi, Honor, and Lenovo plan to integrate Qualcomm Seamless into their devices to enable seamless connectivity between multiple devices from different manufacturers. So there you have it. These were all of the highlights and announcements from the Snapdragon Summit 2023 event. So what do you think of the new Snapdragon X Elite? Will it revolutionize the CPU market? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.